Hi everybody. So this week, guess what? We are going to learn about hand ties. So I especially brought these two rope to show you guys what is a hand tie all about. So let's move on. I think we better go to the basic of hand tie first. So a lot of us we are confused what is a throw and what is a loop right so imagine this is a suture no, this is a trade right so what is a loop you can do this this is considered a loop and actually we will call this a throw all right so when you do a simple knot this is a single throw so, but when you do a surgeon's knot, you're going to. This is not a single throw, but this is actually a double throw. So, one throw is one loop. Some of my students ask me, you really can use the uh, instrumental tie, but if you have learned how to do a hand tie, you, will, you can do the procedure faster because you can do the knot faster and you can also feel the tension of the knot better and there is some instances where it's not possible for you to use the instrumental type like going into the deep tissue ah, so that's where the hand tie comes in handy there is also side effect of the hand tie because no! it might be for superior As I promised for one of my previous video, I promise you guys to show you what is a granny knot. Granny knot is not the knot that you want. Alright? Granny knot is the knot that you don't want. Because granny knot will slip. A granny knot happens when you don't square your knot. As one of my previous video that have shown you that what is a square of knot all about. Right, so what happened is you see you do like this and you do like this. Alright, you don't square your knot. You see the knot is not square. Right. You, let me show you the proper simple knot. Right. So it's a proper simple knot. Can you see the difference? This is a simple knot. And this is a granny knot. See, the granny knot is not square. It's, look at this simple knot is square. The granny knot is not square, and it loses its grip. The simple knot won't lose the grip as much. In order to prevent a granny knot, you must have a conscious decision when you do the hand tie. There's always a short end and there's always a long end. The long end is always where the needle is, right? Okay, and the short end is the end of the suture. There's a lot of variation of doing the hand tie and I'm showing my variation. And the, look at this, all right? You just make a split over your index finger and your middle finger. And the thumb is holding the end of the tray and it comes down here in the middle so that your middle finger can hook up when your middle finger hook up you okay when you pull a lot of my students they pull like this not a good way you should put your finger push in rather than pull out all right why if you pull out you don't know the tension over the end of the knot right when you push in you will know the tension of the knot okay so this is the first throw for the second throw you see just now was down right this was down now this is out right and you put in the middle just now was in this finger now is the middle finger that took out okay then you see the knot is square and I don't know if you see that I am crossing my hand and remember it's always
days, three to five throws, right? Right? Okay. So when you already up here, you see automatically it will be like this. And you can put your longer end there and hook up again. Alright? So that you'll be squaring and wow this is a rather short. Alright, you can just put so four strokes and you can see there are two squares there. Right, so this is not a really is not this is a simple knot. So after you have seen all oh, the big rope, I will say there's a suture. Okay, so this is a suture one, size one. Right, this is a body cladding 910 size one. Right, so let's say this is the tissue. Right, so what happened was you do like this. Right, okay, and then you see it coming down and come down like that then they go up like that all right so that is a simple knot sometimes we want the grip to be more when the grip to be more we use a surgeon's knot remember the formula 211 right okay you can do like this one two and remember push down the knot rather than pull out eh? push down the knot so this is actually a two throws right and then to end it just now was the index finger right so now it's the middle finger and you see it is a square so this is a three throw after the third throw put the fourth throw so this is a surgeon's knot. There is also a variation of a surgeon's knot. We call it a two-hand surgeon's knot. So what you do is you hook the same thing, short end and long end. But the problem with two-hand surgeon's knot, you shouldn't have any needle, right? This is where maybe towards the end, where this one is down, right? This one is up, and you hold like this. You cross each other. Right, and then you pull then you see see this is the first throw and second throw because just now this and is facing towards down so we now we go up so this is a two hand surgeon's knot right we always end it with four throws remember yeah four throws is better than three but some instances where we purposely do a granny's knot <laughs> just now i told you not to put a granny's knot we want to prevent a granny's knot but this is another variation where we call it a gliding knot all right sometimes when the you need to put the knot in deeper tissue all right so you need to push down so you purposely don't tie it so tightly right so you do one okay and then you push two so because this is a granny stop you still can pull out then end it with a simple knot so this is called a gliding knot hand tying needs a lot of practice and patience all right so you can always review back this uh, video to look at a uh, few knots uh, that I'm trying to show you actually hand tie is easy so thank you for today uh, I hope you guys have learned something today and please remember to like subscribe and hit the notification button and I guess this is the last lecture for the suture series um, well, probably we will talk about other new topics for the coming week. Please stay tuned for the same time, same day, same channel. This is Kesuj. Bye.